I layer. I, hmm, I get in there. I got every right how to talk. How I wanna talk. Catch me on a flight down south. Hey, Emmys, I'm Jasmine Emerald, and today I'm continuing my deodorant series where I pretty much share my experiences using different deodorants and coming to terms with which deodorants are best to use if you're looking for a different deodorant. <laughs> And today I'm going to be talking about Ban, and the scent that I use is the Powder Fresh. Now I have been using this off and on for about a year, and one of the main reasons why I started using it is because I went over to my mom's house one day, and I noticed she was using it, and I kind of liked the way it smelled on her, so I was like, let me go ahead and try it for myself and see if I like the way it smells on me. <laughs> so I did. And I wanted to share with you guys my personal experience within using it as far as with armpit hair and without no armpit hair because I did do both as well as I wanted to share with you guys my experience with it during workouts too. If you're interested in buying this deodorant by the end of this video, links will be in the description box down below. Now, as far as the scent goes, it's nothing fancy. It's pretty much just called Powder Fresh. This is the roll on one and it honestly just smells like a regular deodorant brand there's nothing fancy about it if i'm being completely honest but for the most part it did do the job as far as keeping me smelling powdery fresh if you will but i how do i say with armpit hair, I would say you do have to add more to your armpits because because of the way hair traps scents and traps smells, your natural odor will peak out way quicker. However, when I had my armpit shaved, I didn't have to re-up and refresh and add more deodorant to my armpit as much just because I didn't have any hair. Without hair, I did not layer. I probably just put on one coat first thing in the morning. Why am I saying coat like it's nail polish? But anyway, I, I just put on one coat of this first thing in the morning and I was good. But with armpit hair, I would tend to do two. So I'd do one morning and then probably one midday maybe, depending on what I was going to be doing later or what I was doing later. This deodorant is under $5. However, sometimes I do see coupons for it too within the newspaper. So make sure if you want to save some money, you can do that. I believe you I believe you can buy this from like the drugstores as well as from Target, Amazon, Walmart. So it's easily available for you to pick up. All right, so now we're going to talk about my experience within using it as far as workouts. So firstly, I'm going to talk about within working out with it when I didn't have ar armpit hair. So when I didn't have armpit hair, I didn't really have any issues as far as funk. I, you know, do my regular... I don't even have a regular workout. Let's be completely honest. I would sporadically work out. It was very inconsistent. I'm not going to lie to you. However, there were some days where my boyfriend and I would hang out with our friends and we would do some voyages, some hiking. I'm going to call it hiking because it was a lot of walking. If, if it's more than two hours of walking, it's hiking to me. Actually, no, if it's more than 30 minutes of walking, it's hiking for me. But anyway, if there was a lot of movement and I didn't have any armpit hair, this did the job. I still smelled powdery fresh. I still smelled pretty good. It was given the deodorant scent. I'm not going to hold you unless you like layer over some perfume over you or something. You potentially might smell the powdery fresh scent through your clothes. So just a heads up. But it's not off-putting so you don't have to worry about that. Now as far as working out with armpit hair, because I did work out a few times with my armpit hair while wearing this deodorant. And if I'm being completely honest... You do have to layer this. And what I mean by that is, is for example, if I put on deodorant, if I take a shower and I put on deodorant at 8 a.m. in the morning, and if I decide, yeah, I'm going to go to the gym at 12 p.m., or if I decide I'm going to go to the gym at 7 p.m., 
you're going to need to put on the deodorant right before you work out, put on another layer just to help you out because I'm not going to lie. If you think you're just going to go to the gym or work out and not put this freshly on those pits and you have hair on, if you do not do this, what's going to happen is that natural odor stank scent is going to peek right through. And I'm not going to hold you. It's... Depending on how your natural body odor is and how it mixes with this and how your body chemistry goes with this, it might not be bad. However, it could be worse. I'm not <laughs> I'm not going to hold you. But I feel like this happens with most deodorants because I know for me, whenever I plan on doing a lot of moving, a lot of working out, I always layer up. I do a double layer. When I'm like, oh, we're about to do something, I layer, I, I get in there because you don't want it to be a situation where you're not covered, where you're not fresh. And you do have to think about that. So if you have armpit hair, I'm, I'm just saying double up. Okay. But overall, if I gave you guys an overall verdict of this deodorant, I would say great if you're hairless. If you do have armpit hair, though, double up. Like, literally, that's my verdict. If you got armpit hair, double up. If you're hairless, you're probably good to go. But again, you would have to try it for yourself because sometimes body chemistries can come up with something different. So it's just something to be mindful of whenever you try deodorants. But that's my spill on Van Deodorant. If you guys want to buy it, I'll leave a link in the description box down below to an assortment of different places you can purchase it from. But I hope you guys check out my other deodorant videos where I will be doing reviews as well as workouts so I could be testing them in different ways to see if they actually keep you fresh to the test, you know. But hope you guys are doing well. Stay blessed. Stay positive. Stay fresh. That was so cringy. <laughs> but I'll be seeing you guys soon.